And now I'm in the General Assembly, the largest room in the UN where world leaders will be giving speeches throughout the day. This is the view from the media bullpen up in the balcony. World language interpreters are here, photographers are scattered here and here and here, and here is where all the delegates of each respective country sit. Every year before the General Assembly, they randomly select a country name to pick their seating first. Then the countries sit in alphabetical order starting from that selected country. Every single member of the United Nations who attend with a head of state or government has a 15 minute allotment of time to address the world with the state of affairs from their perspective. Many attendees listen to the speeches on this little doohickey. Interpreters interpret the speeches in real time. Okay, it looks like we're ready to get going. General Assembly President Dennis Francis just hit the gavel and officially the assembly commenced. And there's US President Joe Biden. Notice here how many delegates were in the room ahead of Biden's speech. And look how empty the room became once his speech ended. It stayed roughly this empty the rest of the afternoon. About 12 speeches later, here's Ukrainian President